that wasn't, that was okay. I can kind of remember that. But now the tangent one, now what, what, what do we have with x's? Well, again, it's the same thing. Is this a point on the unit circle? Well, we don't really know. We don't know the value of x. It could be, right, if, for some value of x, but we don't know what the value of x is. However, based on this information, can we create a triangle? Sure. Now, is there any positive or negative? Is there any negatives here? No. So therefore, we know that it has to be a triangle in the first quadrant. And we could draw it in the first quadrant, or we can just do you know, float. We know everything's going to be positive. So again, we think about this. This is the adjacent over the opposite. So the adjacent side is x. Sorry, hypotenuse. And this is your hypotenuse. Again, you're kind of confused with that. Cosine of some angle is equal to x over square root of x minus 4. Right? All right, so now to find the tangent, though, we've got to figure out what this is. Right? So let's call this b. So now what we're going to want to do, though, is we're going to want to um, solve for b in terms of x. So to do that, we're just going to do the Pythagorean theorem. So I'd say x squared minus 4, sorry, square root of x minus 4, sorry, squared is equal to x squared plus b squared. Well, that just gives you x minus 4 equals x squared plus b squared. Subtract the x squared. And uh, that was supposed to be an x squared. Yeah, well, so I have a negative x squared plus x minus 4 is equal to b squared. But again, to solve for b, we're going to take the square root of both sides. Therefore, b is equal to, should I use plus or minus, or just keep the plus? Just plus, right? Because we know it's in the first quadrant. Question? Uh, like, is that maximum number what, what is the negative x squared? I mean, we're going to have a restriction. Right? There's obviously certain numbers that would not work for in there, but um, like we have a domain restriction, right? Obviously now, like anything under a radical, you're going to have a domain restriction here for the values. But again, that's not, what we're at, that's not what the question is asking. The question is just asking, write the equation in terms of write the tangent. So if you were to write the tangent here, you would have negative x squared plus x minus 4 all over x. And that is the tangent of, so you use the cosine inverse to create your triangle, use the Pythagorean theorem to find your missing side, and then you just write the tangent of your angle. Now, um, more of a typical problem, you probably would not get something that looks that crazy.